one that's rapping, oh my god, oh my god, if I die, I'm a legend. Yo, what's up guys, it's Lion, and usually I'd be recording a cut com or maybe an outside vlog or something for the day, but instead I have something a little more important to talk about, and I was gonna do a skip for it, but I kind of want to stay serious with this, I'm not trying to make it a joke, because I really want to get my point across on this and hopefully cause a change. So as you guys can probably tell by the title, uh, Face Jet blocked me. And now the thing is, I have two Twitter accounts, one for like my personal and one for gaming. And I had notifications turned on for both of them, so I was getting notifications on my normal account, so it looked like Jeff still didn't have me blocked. And if you need proof for that, it's right here. But so one day I saw all these people tweeting out, oh, hey, Jeff followed me, and I'm like, man, I wonder how they're all doing that. So I go click over to Jeff's page, and I see I'm blocked. Now, if you guys don't know, I've been watching Jeff since 7th, 8th grade, so like 5, 6 years. I've watched almost all of his videos, liked all his videos. He followed me for a while. I've talked to him in Xbox Party Chat. Like, this guy has just been a big part of my gaming life ever since I started. And that's why I was really bummed out when I saw this. Because honestly, still right now, I don't exactly know what it is that I got blocked for. I don't spam him. I don't tweet at him a lot. I've never talked crap about Jeb. I love Jeb. I still watch his videos every single day. So I don't know if it's an accident or a glitch in Twitter or something. But if I did do something wrong, I'm extremely sorry for it. I would never want to do anything to hurt Jeb. I mean, I love the guy. I watch him all the time. He keeps me entertained. He's just fun to watch. He's one of the few people I haven't gotten bored of in this COD community. And I honestly feel like I let him down or did something wrong that caused me to get blocked. And I feel awful about it. Like when I saw it, if you were watching my Twitter, I was tweeting for an hour about how bummed and awful I felt that I would do something that would make Jeb want to block me. Why I'm making this video and the goal of this video is hopefully that Jeb sees it. So what I've done is I've put Jeb's tag in the title. So if you like the video, that'll tweet it at him. And also down in the description below, there's a link to a click to tweet. And down there you can click and it'll tweet out at Jeb and saying, hey, you know, unblock me or something. Jeb, if you're watching this, I'm extremely sorry. Whatever I did, I didn't mean to offend you. I've watched you for five, six years, like I said. You're an amazing dude. I've talked to you before in party chats, like you, me, and Emma. We did that like two or three times a year or two ago. So I'm sorry for whatever I did. I hope you can forgive me. If this was an accident, hopefully we could fix this. I tried to maybe get Mojo or D-Pad to talk to you, but I know you're really busy. So again, I'm sorry for whatever I did. Sorry, this is a short video, guys. That's all I have to say. And I want to keep this serious and straightforward because I'm not trying to make this a joke. I feel awful about it. It'd be like if you have someone you looked up to and you upset them to where they wouldn't want to talk to you. That's kind of how I feel right now. And if this whole thing is an accident, then no worries. We're all good. I just want to make sure it's not. Or if it is that I can apologize for whatever I did and know what I did so I don't do it in the future and hopefully get unblocked. So again, if you guys could leave a like on this video and check out the link in the description below, that would be greatly appreciated. Tweet those at Jeb and hopefully it'll help me get unblocked. If not, I don't know what to do. I'd be really bummed out about it, to be honest. I'm not the guy that he says was talking hate about his clip. I don't know who that was. But again, Jeb, I'm really sorry for whatever I did. Hopefully you can unblock me and forgive me or if it was an accident, fix it. And also tell me what I did because I'm really confused on what it is. Like I didn't notice it and then I randomly saw I was blocked. So I don't know what time zone it was in. I don't know what exactly I tweeted. But usually I don't tweet things that are really offensive. That's why I'm kind of confused. I'm not doing something that's straight out directly trying to offend someone. I may make a joke that's a little too far every once in a while, but even that's extremely rare. And if I hear it is, I take it down. My jokes are less offensive than Nuda's and people love Nuda's jokes. So I don't see the problem, but whatever it is, I'm really sorry, Jeff. Hope you can forgive me. Tell me what the reason was and hopefully unblock me. Please make sure to like this video and click the link down in the description below for it to tweet at Jeb. I'll like and retweet all of yours. Hopefully spread it. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe. Jeb, again, sorry if you want to hit me up. I know I'm being repetitive, but I really want to make sure this is all good. Thank you all so much for watching. Please remember to like, subscribe, and YouTube. We'll see you later.